what is going on folks as you can see I have these three Jordan 1 sitting right here and today I'm gonna give you a quality comparison between the three on my left we got the 2018 bread toe in the middle of course we got the 2016 or is it 17 2016 shattered backboards and then we have the metallic red OG and uh, in my opinion all three of these shoes have nice leather you know you hear a lot of talks about the bread toe versus the shattered backboard and which is better I'm not gonna get into that I just want to get into the three different types of uh, leather that they put on these shoes it's actually more types we have the bad and the breads uh, the older pairs and we have the frags different stuff like that which I don't have in my collection so I'm gonna just do these starting with this metallic right here starting with the metallic right here it has that nice leather going around the whole shoe and if you guys don't know when you wear the shoe you tend to see how much better the leather is than what it is when it's brand new because you break it in it's an all white shoe so you really can't tell how good the leather is and I'm gonna tell you something a lot of people think because the shoe is has tumbled leather that's the best leather but it's really different types of quality leather we have the tumble we have that old school genuine leather like on the Ben collection which I think is the dopest in my opinion but honestly I see why people would think that the tumble is the best because it looks the best because it's like wavy but far as the good quality I wish I had a Ben or something to show you but if you look closely at this it's actually semi tumbled on the sides and then you come around to the toe box it has a slight tumble to it and when you press in on it when you press in on that toe box it's very soft bounce back action in the toe box let's get to the bread toe the bread toe is in talks of being one of the best quality once these released or before they release we had a youtuber that was saying that these are better than the shattered backboards and once he said that people was going crazy no nah, they're not better they're not better but honestly they're up there with the shatters i don't think they're better but they have they have they're better than the royals and the black and reds from last year toe box soft we got that tumble inside the toe box and then we got the tumble going around the whole shoe excuse that trash can in the back trash uh, truck in the background so this is why they kind of compared these to the shatters because of the tumble they see dope leather on both shoes but I can't really say what's the best well I'm not going to say what's the best right now <laughs> maybe at the end of the video so stay tuned check out the other pair and another thing, some shoes, like for those of you that have doubles of certain shoes, you can tell that the leather may vary. Like I had the Royals, uh, the 2016 Royals, or the 17, I'm getting my years mixed up. But I got one pair from Foot Locker, and I got one pair from Chic. And the leather was different on certain parts of the shoe. So they don't do every shoe the same. So it can vary. You might have a Royal or this bread toe 
might might not be as good as someone else's bread toe. They might have a bread toe that's tumbled all over or has nice leather. I'm not going to use tumble. It has nice leather all over. Now, these are very broken into. I wore these a lot, as you can see. But if you look on the side, it's like severely tumbled. That's why people will say that this is the best shattered, I mean, the best quality. Check out that toe box compared to the bread toe. You can see right there that it's, it, it looks more tumbled or whatever. And I'm not going by the tumble saying that that's good leather, but if you feel this, it feels like a purse. It feels like a real good leather purse. It's very, it's much more softer than this. This one is solid. The bread toe is like a, uh, I'm not gonna say flat, but it's like, it's more stiffer than the shattered backboards. The shattered backboards feel very, very soft around the entire shoe, especially the middle part, the sail part. Now let's check out these again. You put them all three close. Let me zoom in. On all three. You tell me which leather you think looks good. That's the shattered. That's the bread toe. And that's the metallic. With the metallic being white, you can't really see the creases in it. Maybe on the side. But you guys tell me what you think is the best leather. And which ones do you have? Which ones do you like the best? Which ones are your favorite Jordan ones? Oh, geez. Uh, honestly, if I had a chance to acquire one of the OGs from 1985 or 94, those are automatically better in my opinion. Even the way they look, yellowing and everything, that's a grail of mine. I'll be so happy once I pick up one of those shoes and have it in my collection and I will actually wear it no matter how much it costs because the good thing about those old uh, Jordan ones, you can wear them forever because it has that, it has that stitched in sole. The mid sole doesn't crack or nothing like that. Let me compare the heels of the shoes before I get out of here. Shattered, bread toe, metallic. The heels always look the same to me. When you get to the bread toe, at the back of this one, and this is DS as you can see, so it has a slight tumble to it. And then as you get to the bottom, it's that flat, hard leather. The heel of the shoe will, is going to be hard because of the material that they put in it. You might get like a soft layer on the outside, but it's going to be hard because that's the heel of your foot. If they had it soft, then the, the shoes would be real flimsy. They wouldn't stand up. But yeah, man, check out all three. And you once again, you just tell me what you think is the best quality and which one would you prefer and not by resale value just by colorway or leather. I'm gonna get up out of here, hit that like and subscribe, follow me on all social media, links will be in the description. Peace. In the nose of a hoe, hooded Joe, plenty snow, you can call it Jericho, clean mode, like a boat that's full of dope, I stay afloat, like a pilot full of smoke, I'm higher than a mountain goat, very low.